Hey you, it's Jess here and welcome back to my channel. Today we have a fun haul. It's got a lot of scribble prints co as per usual, so sorry about that, but I love this PC, so let's get straight into it. I'm excited. Timestamps are listed below. So the first thing I just wanted to show were some Simply Gilded washies. The first are these three rolls. These are the polka dot rolls. So you have the black polka dot and the Valentine's Day set and this is uh, silver and pink with heart polka dots and this is just circular ones with gold and red and this is black and gold and I got these in a trade from Sadie Stickers so definitely check out her shop. Anyway, she's she was an awesome trade partner and I'm so happy I just asked on my Insta stories and she happened to be interested in what I had. So I traded for those and I've also traded some more for some other washi coming later so I'll keep you updated. I use the Facebook group for official trading and selling so we'll see. I also picked up some samples from Washi Full of Simply Gilded. This is before I did this trade so I've got the three dots here as well. But I'm probably going to give these to a friend. Um, I also picked up the two lots. So you can see there's some are thick and some are thin. It's because I bought one more than one sample. I think it's 24 inches. I also got these silver bows, both skinny and thick. And I also just traded for those. So once those come in, I'm going to give these to a friend as well. And then I got the champagne and pink gold bows at the top here, definitely keeping that for myself. I only own the original hot gold bows and the roll's getting a bit small. I'll show you compared to like a new roll. So this is my old one of the hot gold. How sad is that? No! So I just bought a ton of the samples of this because no one's letting go of their gold bows at the moment, but I will. So this lot is going to a friend. And then I got the uh, rainbow blocks, because I thought, why not? And then the blue um, uh, little confetti dots there in a holographic spot. So I got those from Washi Full. She updates her shop with new Simply Gilded Washi, as well as all the others, like Michaels and stuff. So... Uh, Disney and all sorts of things so definitely check her shop out but those are the washies I got recently just through different means <laughs> than buying from Simply Gilded. The next shop super excited I got some more pumpkin paper co terrors in this was my PBC order I think she just had a ton of orders and so it took her a while to get through them but I'm super excited. Um, I just got a whole bunch of terrors in black hair and some die cuts. I'll show you the die cuts first. I picked up this set of like um, autumn mugs. So you have Hello Fall, just a cute spot, and the eyelashes one. And just Terra is lying aside them. And I think you could pick the hair color. So I picked black as per usual. Um, I thought these were so cute and we're in full now. It's just started today. Um, it's March 1st as I'm filming this. So yeah, I can't wait to put these in some setups. So those are the die cuts. They're really nice, high quality um, cut, like paper. It's not, it's a thinner cardboard, so it's not too thick, but they, they printed really, really nicely. So those are my little die cuts. It also came with this postcard, it's an actual postcard too, with the different terrors, and then just the little um, uh, card with your name on it. So let's get into the terrors that I bought, I'm just going to put them on the desk, and yeah, I can get pretty close in. So the first lot I got here um, was the Mental Health Day, and I think Tara herself has her name Tara was having some issues last year and I totally feel her and I totally needed these mental health day stickers 
I know, I have a lot of mental health days too, because seemingly a lot on Wednesdays. Maybe I have a hump day itis, but <laughs> nonetheless, I had to pick these up, and they're really nice neutral colors, so I really love that. And they just say mental health day, and they have some at the bottom that say they don't have any text. So you can just use them for like sleeping in. Then I picked up Terra in the bathtub. And it's a gorgeous bath. It's pretty big um, with wires, but you can sort of be like plop on a half box and you know it's it's me time in the bath. And as colder weather is coming, I'm definitely going to take some more baths. I have a whole box of Lush going to waste because it's just been too hot and the light in our bathroom was broken so I can only use the heat lamp for light. <laughs> and then it gets too hot. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to using these baths. They're just really pretty with the floral. Then I totally needed these. It is hiding under a blanket and it says hiding from my problems. Yep, I do that all the time, hiding from my PhD. So I had to get those. Then I got the warm and snuggly reading with the cat on her lap, so cute. I don't know if I've ever worn red lipstick for reading, but <laughs> super fancy, cute, lots of different colors. Will be perfect for the season coming up. Then I got the bunch of laptop terriers and she's just on a little um, apple laptop in some slightly different colors, really pretty. I just use the black, gray, and pink ones a lot, and then the gray is sort of um, an extra color. <laughs> then I got these sort of like emoji heads, so um, with the glasses. I think there's one without glasses. Um, but you've got like some blank expressions down the bottom here. You have um, feeling sick, you have happy, you have sort of annoyed, super happy, uh, confused almost. Lots of different happy ones, but also lots of different faces that I totally use. I'll show you up front. Those are super duper cute. Can't wait to pull those in. <laughs> then I got the Planet Girls, and it's sort of, it's an interesting colorway. It's like a, I think it's supposed to be Mickey Mouse, like Disney kind of planner colors. So you got the yellow, red, and black with some peach in there as well and I just thought that was so adorable with the bows in their hair so I had to get those and get a ton of them. <laughs> That's the cool thing about pumpkin paper co you get a ton of terrors on your sheet. It'll never run out. I got the Disney ones even though it's nothing really Disney where I live so but whenever something Disney comes up I can use them. They're so cute. Just wanted them in my collection. And last thing I got was a, I think it's the newest sampler sheet. So there's a few ones from what that I bought, like the bathtub and the Disney. Um, but there's a whole bunch I didn't buy here and I actually would be really fun to try them out. I just think the sampler is really useful just to see what you may or may not use and want to pick up in the future. Or if you just need one or two of one thing. Um, just nice to have on hand. So that was my Pumpkin Paper Co. order. And I'm super excited. I love them all. They're so cute. Especially these die cuts. Look for those in the future. And the last order I had before we get into Scribble Prints Media is this one from Two Little Bees. She brought out a Valentine's gift called Sweetheart and I was able to she did some pre-sales after it sold out and I'm so glad I picked up one of those pre-sales. So of course with that and then shipping to Australia it didn't get in time for Valentine's or Feb really for that matter but I am just happy to have it and I don't mind the weight. So I'm actually thinking I'm going to use this kit for my anniversary in August so that's why I didn't really mind waiting for it. Um, I can never catch her when her stuff goes on sale, so I just really appreciate the pre-sales for Two Little Bees. But the first thing she included was this cute little heart doily. Adorable. Definitely keeping that around. And it came, the kit came with a large little freebie extra. You've got the 
um, munchkins from Once More Love featured on here as well, and the huge, the big deco, and just ugh, adorable. I'm sure everyone's already seen it like in plan as in plan with me, so I'm just gonna quickly go through it, but I think it's just so cute, and I'm so happy that it arrived. So you have the full boxes here, it says you will forever be my always. And I thought it's perfect for Valentine's, but also I think it will work for a really cute and sweet um, anniversary week, just something really girly and fun. So that's what I'm going to use it for. Just really pretty. I love these florals. Then you get the flags, icons, word stickers, and deco. So pretty. I love how she included all these little bows now as well. Those are perfect for you, for decorating heart boxes and things. And the patent weekly box, three heart checklists, some more of those decorative headers, um, some decorative functional stuff. And you get the kettlebells, I love them, and family time, date night. Love that coffee. I love how the planner and this is the planner from the clip art. You have some bill juice, some appointment labels, you know, all of that stuff. So pretty. I love the addition of some black colors as well in this. Uh, here you have some decorative um, headers and little things and normal headers. Then you have her clip boxes, and this is where I really love the added black patterns. Half boxes, more headers, day covers with the adorable bow. All of these bow strips down the bottom are cut out, so you can use those. Some appointment labels. You get tons of stuff in her um, sticker sheets now. Um, so it's very easy to use this over two spreads. You have the check boxes, as well as a pretty decorative type of one. Uh, and it's all got deco in them, so cute. And then you have the little arrows at the bottom. And then you have the bottom washi. She changed this up a bit, so you have some proper appointment labels in here. Some pattern washi. You also get this... Oh, that's a washi strip too. I think that's happened to other <laughs> people in their hauls. But you have this thinner bottom washi with the typewriters. And then she made these... Bow strips to go across the top. I don't know if I will. I might bring in some um, washi, even some of this Valentine's Day washi, like the even the black or the pink. I think I would use gold with this kit, so maybe the polka dot black would be cute. We'll see. Or a skinny washi. But then that'd be really cute. Uh, but that was the Sweetheart collection. Definitely join Tula B's Facebook group to find out when she does releases. She usually does pre-sales now, which I appreciate so much. Maria is so awesome for accommodating like the rest of us who can't who can't get up before 30 a.m. I just love this. I've got another one, her last set coming in the mail as well now. It just shipped. So I'm super excited. But that was Sweetheart from Sweetheart? Sweet. Sorry. <laughs> yes, it is Sweetheart. Sweetheart from Two Little Bees. Okay, I got a whole bunch of Scribble Prints Co. I think this is one big order and then this is one order. So we'll do the small one first. This is for $3 Thursdays. So for this th $3 Thursday release, she brought out a special journaling card. It was this cute bunny girl, perfect for Easter. And I just love how simple they are. And you can just slip them into any TN spread or even um, frame them as well as really cute illustrations. So that's the freebie journaling card. And then I also got the Scribbler freebie that was at the time. And then I got my $3 Thursdays, so uh, that's pretty much as it says, they're $3 Thursdays. I think this is my second one that I've shown. The first one I only got like two sheets, but this is a proper one lot here. And uh, every month she's going to be doing the same color across each week. 
Uh, so this is the pink one. And um, I think, I'm sorry, watching this, you would have missed the last pink week. But I'm excited to see what the new color is. But I'll go through the sheets. They're all kind of functional or decorative. So you have the flight trackers in pink. Perfect. Just to have in my collection. Uh, there's these girly thing items, which are actually my art from my Queen clip art set. Um, so she used these for more functional. Uh, so you see, have the Dior nail polish, the perfume bottle, the little phone, the candle, the cute satchel bag, and two little melted lipsticks. So I love the way she colored those, and they just look really pretty. And she added a little bow and a little heart to the candle and perfume. Can be used to mark so many things. So of course, I bought two because, you know. <laughs> Not just because of my art, but because this will be really useful. Then I picked up a sheet. Did I pick up two or just one? Just one. I picked up a sheet of the glitter flags. You get the big ones and the small ones that fit the neutral. Just to have those. And this is her newer glitter texture. I picked up the glitter appointment labels. I think I had the plain ones in the last haul. So I picked up the glitter versions this time because I love these appointment labels. And this pink really goes with everything, to be honest. Then you have the glitter half boxes and quarter boxes. And I bought two of those so you can make up like a whole set. Um, just to have those. So that was my $3 Thursdays. So really happy with those. And that was the cards. So that was that order. Next order, I got a bunch of kits. I'm going to go through the extras first, and I'll walk through one of the ultimate kits. They're all ultimates, um, and then we'll just have a look through the others. So the freebie card for this order was this really cute drawing by me. I should say not really cute, but because I drew it. Uh, but you know humble and all um, but this is the wheelchair girl I drew for the bus clip art I think it just looks so chic and pretty and I, I think I actually want to frame this one that'd be so cute and also um, just to be like hey I drew that it's so pretty <laughs> so that was the card that came out for this week and then I got the scribbler freebie uh, this is the new one, obviously, and it's for St. Patrick's Day. Awesome! I think you can use a lot of these year-round as well. And then she included this sticky notepad. So it's a whole notepad. She just put a little heart on it. So thank you for that. And these are the um, these are the post notes I went in a three-year bundle, didn't they? So pretty special. <laughs> um, but I'm happy to have another one of those. I use these all the time. And then we got the 75 plus freebie because I don't spend that much. Um, and it's the gold St. Patrick's Day version. Really nice. And then I just got the glitter headers to go with each kit. Um, so this, these two, the gold and the um, sort of neutral colors go with the marvelous kit. <laughs> Um, based on my artwork. So I just got both because I could use gold anyway. Uh, it depends on my mood. And then I have gold or these pretty neutral colors in my collection. Then I got one set of glitter headers for hats off. Like in retrospect, maybe I should have bought two because I bought two of the kit, but I thought I could do them slightly different ways. I could also bring in gold glitter if I wanted, so I could even save like this gold glitter for the second hats off. But we'll see, so I got those. And I got the matching glitters for spring break. I don't know. I just easy to have them and if I don't use them then I can put them into my collection for other use. So there's the extras. I'll go through the first ultimate kit and then just show you the rest of them. So I don't do too much because she has new release videos and you can go see that when you want. But she also included these little TN planners. I think they're still for sale in our shop, at least at uh, the time of filming. Um, so these are really cute. Again, <laughs> I say they're cute, but I drew them, but you know. <laughs> 
Um, so you can get these TN die cuts. They're just on vinyl stickers. So you should just pop these into these. I think a lot of these kits came with these, like the first 200. So that's awesome. Then you get the freebie. So I really tried to make everything super, like the kind of colors people are into at the moment, super neutral and soft. And she used all the sort of, um, yeah, the mauve colors and the light blue. So you have all the deco. Love it. Got tons of deco at the top. And then the scribblers you have included other champagne and a pretty dress and the nail polish. Then the, um, this is the functional sheet and then you get the sort of um, marble with dots of uh, confetti of glit glitter through them. I don't know why I'm struggling. And they have the mauve color around the edge of the um, things. <laughs> I just completely lost my words. But anyway, you, you guys know what these kits look like. And then you have this sheet and the half boxes have some of the patterns in them. I like how she uses sort of the marble and the grid patterns. I just love grid. I don't know why. I'm obsessed with grid at the moment. So you have the pattern wash you with the same what um, patterns as in the half boxes. And a lot of these like dots, these speckles are actually like hexagons. I think they're supposed to be hexagons, so they're sort of graphic as well in that sense. Get the headers, the little things, uh, labels and washi. And then she did that um, whole glitter and marble throughout. Really pretty, love that. Just so soft and simple. Then you have the full boxes. Oh, I adore this. This is my clip art where I did some women with disabilities. I was planning to do them for a while and then I got a request specifically for a girl boss kind of kit with, with the women with disabilities and I was happy to do it. I just, uh, I got really into doing this set. And I'm so happy with how it came out. I love how she put all three of the uh, women in there. I was pretty nervous about releasing it. I don't know why. So I drew like a woman without physical looking disabilities or you could say that she has uh, invisible you know that's how I kind of saw it but I thought maybe if people didn't want to use them which uh, you know the onus is on them but if they didn't they had a, a normal looking woman but I think they're all gorgeous and I love the way they put together and I love the way Andrea put it together um, she used the letter board that says empowered women empower women. I just love that quote. <laughs> and then she put in her quote uh, in the iPad, just a girl boss building her empire. I just love these like ladies kicking butt and leading the world basically. <laughs> so I just, I just love the flat land of the girls and oh, I just love the way this came out. And then look at this bottom while she the gold bows and she's done the double it's still one piece but you get the double effect of washi there just love the gold bows and the that she used the paint strokes and the gold date covers and the Prada bag here at the extra I'm totally into Prada bags I doubt I'll ever own one but <laughs> I just love them <laughs> the way they look so that was the Marvelous kit, and I love this. I just don't know when I'm going to use it, but I'm going to use it soon-ish, don't I, guys? It's too pretty. So that was that kit. Now let's get through the other ones. So Andrea uh, reformatted uh, a mystery kit from last year. I actually, I wasn't a huge fan of that mystery kit. Mostly due to, I don't know, the, there was a lot of silver glitter in it, like dark silver glitter and the yellow, and I really wasn't into those. Like, I'm fine with yellow and silver glitter, but the way they were, I don't know, I just, I wasn't feeling it back then, so I gave it away, like, in a giveaway. Uh, but she reformatted it and she brought it all into the pinks, 
and she took away the silver backgrounds and the full box has made them all simple and I just, I love it. And I'm totally going to be saving this for, oh, next year. <laughs> it's pretty summery despite being spring baked to me. Um, but I don't go to like a tropical place in spring. So it's summer it is. But I can't wait to use it. We get the um, freebie here. You can see that deco. I think she just sort of uh, played with the colors a bit. Really brought in that pink. So cute. Oh, and I love this scribble. It has a little um, fire work. Sparkler. Sparkler. That's what it is. So pretty. I just I love these colors now. Perfect to reformat in my opinion. Just getting through all the pages here. Oh, it's just gorgeous. I just love this pink, this green. Now my voice has gone weird. <laughs> I was so being weird. Here are the full boxes. Oh, so pretty. Now I remember it came with a lot of like huge toolboxes with the girls and it was a bit repetitive before and I think she's just upped it to the max. It just really shows how like her designing has come so far. She is such a great eye that she's cultivated. So I love this. I'd rather be at the beach. I mean, I hate the beach. but <laughs> Although I happily drive by the beach and look at everyone enjoying it. But uh, I love this. It's so pretty. And I love this flat lay, double flat lay with the taking the photo of it. So cool. And then you have that double bottom washi with the date covers and extra girl. Lovely. So totally using this next summer. I love it. Ah, unless I go somewhere like tropical. I don't know. So that was the... She called it spring break kit. And then finally I had to get J. Crew Plans Jessica's awesome grad kit. I bought two of them. <laughs> and it was the reason I bought two is that Lachlan is uh, submitting his PhD thesis this year. So he's going to graduate before me. And so I wanted to use one for his graduation week because it's a hell of a graduation. Like... PhD, so probably never going back to uni, <laughs> ever. <laughs> so I had to get one for him, and then I had to get one for me, Ops, uh, because it's adorable and pink and pretty, and even though it's not the exact same kind of graduation, like, I don't think we're going to be doing the bears with their names, and, um, and you don't have a diploma. Although technically we do get PhD diplomas, like, rolled up, in a tube so that works as well. We use a completely different hat. It's like a, a floppy velvet hat which is really hilarious and cool. But this still works right? I know. I just want to put in the senior. I just I'll make it work for my circumstances but I had to get one for each of us so I won't go through the second one. I'll keep that closed up for me. I definitely won't be using it till next year. And I don't know if Lachlan will be catching this the second uh, second half of the year graduations, but we'll see. So I might be using two graduation kits in the same year, but what ifs? Uh, first with the freebie. I just love these colors, and I love this Jessica art. She nailed it, as I think everyone has said anyway, as they should. <laughs> And then you have um, the scribblers, and this one you have a face mask, the little balloon, I love the black balloon, and the champagne, you know, for getting ready for grad and having fun and celebrating. I love how they're sort of matching the kits. Then you have the um, functional, and you can see how you have the sort of streamers in the background here, really pretty. The celebration glitter half boxes. Oh, I love these like glittery streamers and confetti backgrounds. Awesome. Really brings out the best of these colors too. And then the background of the check boxes actually has like people throwing hats, which is pretty cool. <laughs> and then the full boxes. Love those. Um, 
yeah, I think that pretty much will work. I mean, the diploma, I'm technically getting a degree in a diploma. I'm, I don't know. It's all technicalities. I'm going to make it work. I love it. We also have this extra full box with the teddy bear. I don't know. We'll see. We even have different robes, so <laughs> it's like that's why I haven't done a graduation kit myself because our stuff is really different. I think what we call our our robes are the they're the Cambridge type and they're just they're different. They're not like a huge like smock. <laughs> they're like robes that you drape over your shoulders kind of thing. So uh but I love this. It's perfect. I love it. I just love these girls too. Oh. And then you have the <laughs> the, uh, the teddy bear extra box and the bottom washi with the balloons and the glittery gold day covers. <sighs> I can't wait till those days. Then we can be done. <laughs> like after a while, you just you just want to be done, don't you? So I love this. Can't wait to use both of these. So that was everything I got from Scribble Prints Co. This go around week my god a week and a half I would say um, I won't do a big selection I'll just say now like if you like this haul give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe below or when it comes up at the end here and I will see you next time bye